In this video tutorial, you'll learn how to add a preloader image in WordPress. A preloader is an animation indicating the progress of a page load in the background. Preloaders assure users that the website is working on loading the page. This can help improve user experience and reduce overall bounce rate. You can easily add a preloader to your site using a plugin. First, you need to install and activate the preloader plugin. Now, I've already installed it, but if you need help installing a plugin on your website, we have a video explaining how to install a plugin. I'll link it in the description below. Now, click on Settings under the plugin. First, you can change the background color from here. Just enter the color code of the color you want here. Next is the preloader image. You can enter the URL of the image you want to display as preloader here. Just make sure it's of the dimensions recommended. Or you can click here to explore some free preloader images. Next, scroll down to the display preloader section. Here you can select where you want to display the preloader. I'll just leave it to the entire site. Now, the most important step is to copy this code and paste this code in the body section of the header.php of your theme. If this sounds a little confusing to you, don't worry, just follow along. First, click on Save Changes. Then go to Appearance. Then click on Theme Editor. On the right-hand side, under Theme Files, click on the theme header. Make sure you have a recent backup of your website in case anything goes wrong. That way you can always restore the backup. Look for the body section in this code, which is right here. Now paste this piece of code right below this line where the body section starts. Then click on update file. Now one thing to note, whenever you add a custom code to the parent theme, when the theme gets updated, your custom code will be removed, so it's better to use a child theme and add the custom codes to the child theme instead of the parent theme. This way, you can retain the customization you make even when the theme gets updated. Now let's go to the website to see if it worked. And as you saw when the site was loading, a preloader image was displayed. I'll just reload the site so you can see it again. This is how you can add a preloader image in WordPress. That's it for today's video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. And if you like this video, please click on the like button. If you're new to our channel, hit the subscribe button and tap the bell icon so that you don't miss any of our future videos. Thanks for watching. We'll see you at the next one.